Uh, today I'm going to show you the deadlift setup and execution. Uh, main things we really want to focus on in the deadlift setup is that we have a neutral spine and that our hamstrings and our midline are full of tension. We don't want to have a, a rounded back and we also don't want to be loose when we pull off the ground. So we'll cover those in the setup. So to start we want our leg hairs touching the bar if you have leg hairs, so nice and close up. As far as width, we want to be just under our hips. If you have tight hips, turning your feet out can help a little bit if you need that extra range in your hips. But we don't want to be too wide there, so keep that within reason. All right, so I start feet under my hips, leg hairs touching the bar. I'm going to take my hands and grab right outside of my shins. All right, so as you can see now, my back is rounded, so my next job is going to be to flatten that back out. So I'm going to bring my belly button down, creating that nice curve here or at least flatness. Next step we want to do is clean up that shin angle. Right now, that bar path would have to go around my knees. So I want to make sure that I'm pushing my knees back, and this is where we get that tension in the hamstrings. So you should hear a click on the bar before we even move. I have so much tension here that I can almost float that bar up just with the tension I'm creating. So from here, shin angles are back, and my back is, shin, shins are back, and my back is flat. Big breath in, pull my shoulder blades together, and stand. On the way down, we're gonna start with a little bit of an event, then I'm just gonna start shooting my butt backwards, sucking that bar into my thighs, and then into my shins, and bend my knees down to the ground. Now, what you see a lot of people doing um, differently in the deadlift is how high that butt is uh, in the setup. A lot of traditional lifters, or people who do track bar deadlifts, will tell you deadlifts like this, that's not necessarily wrong, but we're working our quads and glutes. I like to do the deadlift to develop hamstrings and lower back. All right, so with that in mind, what you'll see with those lifters who bend a little bit more start here is before the bar moves, the butt ends up here anyway. So I like to start with that tension right from the get-go and start with that tense back there. Give that a shot, let me know.